When the God of Time learned that, Alice's purpose for coming was to borrow the magic ball of space-time. The originally calm God instantly flipped out. He directly ordered the steward to expel Alice out of the Hall of Time. However, a grumpy red-haired woman attracted the attention of everyone in the castle. She barged straight into the Time Lord's room. Does that look familiar? Yes. It does. She's the White Queen's sister. With her distinctive hairstyle, they gave her a fancy name, the Queen of Hearts, and through the conversation between the two, that the God of Time had always had a crush on. This eccentric little darling, I should say no, the taste of the gods, is not the same. And what the gods never expected was that, just as the Red Queen was having a nice chat with him, while she was having a nice chat with him, Alice, who hadn't left the castle, had quietly arrived at the, to save her best friend. In order to save her best friend, Alice couldn't care less. She strides forward, she grabbed the dazzling sphere. In in her hand, and little did she know, the consequences of her actions, how horrific it would be. Countless robots guarding the ball, were coming after her in a frenzy. When Alice got nervous, the ball came out of her hand, followed by, a magnificent time machine, appeared in front of Alice's face.